Debbie Homer Davis and welcome back to babylady.co.uk. We have got with us today the gorgeous new Wow XL in the fantastic new colorway. It's called Bureau. It's absolutely stunning. Passato do colors so well. They just do the most beautiful, vibrant, really lovely, lovely colors. And this new color, this new Bureau is so beautiful. I don't know whether you can see the gold greeny touches in the chassis and all of these absolutely beautiful applique birds. We'll do a close up of these. They're just so, so pretty. And it's just been done really, really nicely. The fabric itself has got this gorgeous, gorgeous herringbone effect, and it really does look absolutely stunning. But the Wow XL is such a really clever product. And we realized we have got the Mr. Fox on our shop floor, but we realized we had not done a video to show you how clever this product is and how many people's lifestyles it will fit. If you're looking for a single pram that is future proof, this may well be the one for you because it comes with all the adapters and the add on pieces to take not just one child, but also two. And you can buy it in various different ways. So you can buy it with a, with a carry cot, a seat unit just on its own, or you could buy it as a bundle with a car seat and a base. And you can also buy it in bundles with uh, bags and foot muffs, or you could swap out the car seat to have a second seat unit if you were using it for a double. But I'm gonna show you some of the ways it works in a little bit more detail, because I know that you love the detail in some of our videos. So we start with our carry cot, and we've popped our carry cot at the moment in the top position. I'm going to show you how the adapters work. If you want to use this for more than one child, you can. Um, but if you were using it for your first child or a single child, you'd put them in this position. And it's very, very simple to take your carry cot off. There's a button on the top here and you press it down with your finger and just lift. It's really, really simple. I do like how easy that is um, to put on and off. And you can, in fact, raise the carry cot up. If you wanted it in the higher position, um, perhaps because you wanted your baby closer to you, you can pop them in the top position as well, which I think is a really nice option. And my hand, if you were very tall and you wanted them closer to you, you can do that as well. So to take our carry cut off, we're going to just slide that button and we'll show you as well inside the gorgeous, gorgeous detailing inside this carry cut. It really is lovely and it does come with a little chick. Um, some people do ask that question. They say, oh, does it come with that? And it does. So if you wanted to pop your seat unit on standardly, and this is just assuming that we're going to use it for one child, we can pop our seat unit into this position. And this is our seat unit. And I do love the fact with the Casato product, all of the pieces are the same size. So if you were having um, this for a baby and a toddler, and we talked about the option of doing that, you could buy two seat units, but you're not buying a smaller seat. And in some of the competitor products, when you have a second seat, it's not as big as the main seat unit, which means if you've got two bigger children, it doesn't last as long. Whereas this one, it does. As you can see, we've got a really big extendable hood with a push away visor. And if I turn it around, hopefully you can see the seat unit, generously sized. Um, I love all this detailing, the detailing is beautiful. And you can take your bumper bar in and out, little button under here, just press it in, easy to take your bumper bar in and out. Um, and obviously you've got five point harnesses. Um, the detailing as well is also inside your hood. Can you see these little birds inside? It really is lovely. And we've also got a ventilation panel on the back of our hood as we did with our carry cot. So to take our seat unit off, it's very simple to do. You've got two buttons, press them in on the side here very easily. And then if you want your seat unit forward facing, you can turn it around the other way. And this is how you would use it, as I said, for one child. If you've just got the single child, you can pop your seat unit on. It does have a built in buggy board. I don't know if you can see at the bottom here. So if you had one child, but you maybe had an older child, three plus year old, and you want them to stand on because they can't walk quite as far as you want to go. It's very, very useful that that is incorporated in this product. And it's one of the things we love about how future proof and how adaptable it really is. So let's have a look, if you want to use it for a baby and a toddler, let's have a look at that as well. So it comes with the adapters, and this is another really great thing about this product, is that it does come with so much stuff included, and very much competitor products, you would have to buy lots of stuff, so you have to spend more money, whereas with this, literally out of the box, you've got everything you need to use for a baby and a toddler um, with a six-month overlap, if you 
need to use it longer, you would need to purchase other things. So we're going to start with our adapters and we need two sets of adapters to turn this into a double. We're going to put these on the back and how this works, so this slides on, I don't know if you can see the slide on bit, what we're going to do is we're going to wrap it around the chassis, I'll put these down so you can see what I'm doing, wrap it around like this and then slide it down so that it locks onto this and we're going to do exactly the same thing with the other one and you want them pointing outwards and backwards, it's very very simple to do and then these we're going to pop into the front. Again, it's really, really simple, um, not complicated, and you can leave these on. One of the really clever things about this is you can leave these on when you fold it. If you're using it between a single and a double, you just leave them on and forget about them. Now we're going to take these ones off because we don't need these now, and they've got a little push-in button here, and you just press the button in and remove them. And I like the fact that you actually do have a very useful pocket on the back here, hopefully you can see this, where you can actually unzip this pocket and if you wanted to you could keep your adapters in there now i do think that's rather clever because we do have reports sometimes where people lose adapters and obviously it's a bit of a pain to replace them so if you've got a nice handy storage compartment obviously all the better um, it does also come with this rather clever little pouch um, and all of your extra adapters are in here you do also get a longer adapter and that is if you are using this for twins which you could also do if you want to put two carry cots on it, you can use that that way as well. At the end of this video, what we'll try and do is print you some different ways in which this can be used. Because for me to demonstrate it in all the different ways, we'd be here all day. So I'm going to show you first of all how to fold it up. Now we've got all the pieces off. You've got an adjustable height handle when you want to fold this chassis. We've got two triggers at the sides here. And you press the button on the side, pull up your triggers, and the chassis will fold down. And it's actually not that much bigger than a standard chassis. If I've got my tape measure, have a little measure, just in case you want to know. Obviously, the sizes are all on the website. So that measures have a look, about 90 centimetres at its longest point. And across wise, it would be 62. You can also take your wheels off. So if you wanted to make it smaller, you can remove your wheels, which is quite a handy feature um, if you've got a smaller boot. And actually, if you look at it sideways, it's remarkably flat for something that adapts so well. So to pop it back up, you've got a release catch on the side here. Just release it with your thumb and literally it just pops back up. So it's very easy to use. I think even if you had a grandparent using it, you'd find it very simple to do. So let's have a check of our handle heights. We know that this is very important to lots of people. So. This has got a very high handle. It does have adjustment. If you're short like me, you can make it a bit shorter, but it goes up to about 111 centimeters, which is pretty high. Um, compared to the average that we've seen on some of the other videos we've done, 111 is quite high. Obviously you can have it lower uh, for people like myself. Right, let's have a look at how we configure it if you've got a baby and a toddler. So what we can do is we can put our carry cot on the back like this and remember these are the same original pieces that you could have been using for a single pram if you've just got one child just line that up you could use these and then use it again so this could be exactly the pieces you've already been using and then we can pop our toddler seat on the front so if you are looking for an investment piece that's going to last you um, that you literally can do whatever life throws at you. This may well be a very good consideration. I say it does come in a choice of colours. This is the brand new Bureau colourway. It also comes in Mr Fox and Pika Forest. Do check out those on our website and do get in touch obviously if you want more details. As you can see as well, when you've got these on, it is accessible to get to your basket. Again, in competitive products, very often it's quite difficult to get into your basket. And I do like that feature as well. So if you are using this with your carry cot, you can also have your carry cot facing you, which is really, really nice. It does give you a little bit more room um, if you have them facing outwards. But if you wanted to put your carry cot the other way, just turn it around, just line it up. Obviously, you don't tip it up like this with your baby in it. And you can pop your carry cot back on that way. So you would be able to walk 
facing with your baby facing you and your toddler facing outwards now there are lots of other configurations that this will do you can put your carry pot on the front and have your toddler facing you there's all sorts of different ways there are I don't know how many different configurations, but many, many different ways of using it. And of course, you can also use it with twins, with two carry cots, and you could use it with two seat units for older children as well. What we wanted to show you was the massive amount of versatility of this amazing product from our friends at Casato. Of course, if you do want to book an appointment to come and see it in person in our Canterbury store, we'd be happy to demonstrate all the different ways that it works. You can check it out on our website at babylady.co.uk. But we do hope you have found this video helpful. If you do, we'd love it if you gave us a thumbs up if you're watching on our YouTube channel. And if you do want to leave a comment, we always really appreciate it. And if you click the subscribe button at the bottom here, we will send you all of the other videos as we record them. Thank you for joining us again today and welcome. we hope you'll come back and see us very soon.